वेलकम माई स्टूडेंट नाउ और डिस्कशन इज अबाउट लॉन्ग फॉर्म ऑफ प्रेडिक्टेबल यू हैव ऑलरेडी सीन दैट एन द मेडलिस प्रेडिक्टेबल और द मॉडिफाइड फॉर्म ऑफ मेडलिस प्रेडिक्टेबल दैट इज मॉडर्न प्रेडिक्टेबल देर वेर सो मेनी सब ग्रुप्स फ्रॉम वन टू सेवन देर वेर फ्रॉम वन टू सेवन ग्रुप वन टू सेवन इच ग्रुप कॉन्टेन्स टू सब ग्रुप्स ए एंड बी सो there are total 14 subgroups and in group number 8 there are three subgroups and group 0 that is one subgroup so total 18 subgroups are there and considering these first i have already stated niels bohr thought about the subgroups and he actually opined that a long form of predictable may be made by omitting the sub groups all the groups will be considered as the main groups and considering this he made a predictable which is known as long form of predictable we have already stated several times long form of It is predictable. In a long form predictable, therefore, there are seven periods. In every type of predictable, number of periods seven. Number of periods seven. Period means the horizontal rows of the element. But number of group in the long form of predictable is eighteen. so there are seven periods and 18 groups in the long form of predictable now we have to know uh, what are the positions of alkali metal alkaline earth metal halogens inert gases and transitional elements in the long form of predictable like the modern predictable number 1 alkali metal are in group 1 in the modern predictable it was in group 1a and in the long form of predictable it is in group 1 and note that the in the modern predictable the groups are written in the roman style but in the long form of predictable the groups are written in normal digital number so alkali metals have been placed in group 1 along with hydrogen alkaline earth metal in the modern predictable was in group 2a here it is in group 2 in the long form predictable the halogen where in group 7a here in the long form predictable 7 plus 10 in group 17 the inert gases where in group 0 that is group 9 here that is in the last group it are placed and last group of the long form of predictable is 18 so inert gases have been placed in group 18 and the transition elements have a wide range they have been placed from group 3 to group 12 so in this long range from group 3 to group 12 they have been placed in in the long form of steric chem now some important alkali metals are sodium potassium etc you have known some important alkaline earth metals are magnesium calcium etc some 
halogens are fluorine, chlorine, bromine, iodine, etc. Stannin. Inert gases like helium, neon, argon, etc. And examples of some transition elements are iron, nickel, cobalt, etc. The elements which have been placed from group 3 to group 12 in a long form predictable other transition elements. And so these are the positions of important types of elements in the long form of periodic table. Now for the this instance, for the first step uh, of the periodic table, you just may learn these positions of the elements in the long form of periodic table. Now we will discuss about the first ionization energy later on. Thank you. For testing your understanding of this lesson and more videos, log on to www.tubelessons.net.